Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have my wax empties from the last six months. Um, there is not a lot in here because I had packed up all my wax except for a few things that were open and I have not been melting. I just, cause I packed up all my wax and all my, all my melters and I was I only had out one in the bathroom and one in my bedroom and I have been just melting things that I had partial cubes of regardless of the season I just wanted to get um, some things done I did keep out a few like sample things that I wanted to go ahead and use up um, so I'll go ahead and start with a couple of those um, I had these Scentsy samples that I had gotten for Mother's Day um, that my mom gave me from Scentsy. Um, she has a coworker that's a Scentsy. I keep wanting to say a sexy consultant, which is not at all what she is. A Scentsy consultant. Um, unfortunately, I didn't really smell any of these. I have kind of a larger room and the pieces were very small. Um, they all smell great in the bag, but once I put them in the melter, um, the scent pretty much completely just disappeared. Um, so I have sea salt avocado, by the sea, now in zen, which was my favorite scent from in the bag. And I got a, when I hovered over, I could, or I was like right next to my nightstand where I have my melter, I could kind of smell this one a little bit. So I don't know if I would re I don't know if I would purchase any of those just because I don't know hardly what they smell like. Um, but I'm not opposed to any of them because, like I said, I did like the smell of them in the bag. Okay, so I think these are the other bags I have. So I pulled out from Elfie Waxy Wonders Cafe Cabano. Frizzle, cookies, and bear claws. Um, I smelled the coffee in this pretty strong, and I do not like the smell of coffee. The smell of coffee actually makes me kind of sick, so I was not a fan of that one, unfortunately. And then next I had this Sassy Wax Melts in the scent. It's really um, hard to read, so I'm going to pull it closer to me real quick. Uh, magical snowball or magical snow fairy pink chiffon pink chiffon thousand wishes and that's it so i really liked this one it was a really nice scent um i probably won't purchase any wax anytime soon i do have still um quite a bit um and if i do continue to want to purchase wax in the future for like my home or whatever I may stick to uh, Walmart wax. Um, I may here or there place an order, and if I do, you guys will more than likely see it. Next year, I have Britta's Creepy Treasures in Pink Flamingo. I think I liked this one. I think this one was a little florally for me. No, this one was fruity, and I did like this one. Couldn't remember, but I did like that one. Okay, now I have a bunch of clams, so I'll go through those next. So I have Better Homes and Gardens Sugared Lavender Twist. This is a 100% favorite. I will always repurchase this as long as they continue to have it. Next here I have Mainstay's Apple Pumpkin. This one was pretty good. I like it because these ones are 98 cents. It has a good throw. They're nice and strong, and I do enjoy it. Next here, I have this dollar store, Rake Pile Leap. This one was pretty good, a little light, but I did like it. Um, another dollar store one was Toasted Marshmallows. Again, I really liked it, but it was a little on the light side. And it also had a slight like burnt note to it, which I get what they were going for, but it was a little too burnt for my tasting. Okay. So then another dollar store one here is this 
Perfect Harvest Butterscotch Spice. This one I don't fully remember, and I think it was kind of light and very spicy. Next here we have Sugar and Berries. This one was pretty good. I didn't love the whole creamy berryness to it. Um, it made me slightly sick like, um, but it was not terrible. I probably would not repurchase it. We'll say that. Um, favorite denim. Well, this is my favorite wax cubes. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, this is by Mainstays. This was a really nice um, men's scent. I really, really, really liked this one. And I would definitely repurchase that one again. Then lastly, I had this Better Homes and Gardens Spice or Pomegranate Spice Cider. I really liked this one. This one was pretty good. Oh, yes. I would definitely repurchase this one again if I saw it. I really liked that one. So that is all. I still have a few more things by my bedside um, that I would like to finish melting. Um, and a few things in the bathroom as well. I did pull out for the bathroom because I do like keeping the bathroom scented. Um, I did pull out a, uh, I think it's L3 baggie of wax melts. So I've been working on that. Um, and I do have some more things by my bedside. Um, so yeah, so hopefully there will be another bath and body or another wax empties after I get moved and settled in. Um, but again, like I said in my other video, I don't want to be carrying around trash with me. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!